It's time for another Out of Bounds Rewind with Bo Bounds on ESPN 105.9, The Zone. Are you hearing that Jeremy Pruitt is out and that they scratched around there and evidently Bama and the SEC couldn't come to terms or what? Well, I, I don't know if he's out. Because um, I'd hire know, him. I, I, I wouldn't know. care. Everybody's cheating. It doesn't matter. There's no more rules. Well, I mean, I mean the, what are we doing? If you go read the 51-page allegation, and you also take into consideration that Tennessee is trying to get out, a broke university is trying to get out of paying about $13 million uh, contract. Sure. They threw so him under the bus. I get it. To, right. Yeah, yeah. So if you read that 51 pages, I mean, we're literally talking about $13 million here. And I think over here in Tuscaloosa, we had a person that wanted 500000 800000 law school admission. I'm sure you probably talked about that over the weekend. That was a story that kind of broke. And Nick Saban told the guy to go pound sand. Uh, and then we're talking about what happened in Tennessee was giving away breakfast coupons. Yes, breakfast coupons. Uh, there's hotel rooms that's involved. There's a small thing of cash. I think it's three or $400 in multiple occasions. But it's hotel rooms. I mean, it's literally hotel rooms. Uh, breakfast coupon. That's comical. So, well, and then compared to what it is in college football, uh, the NCAA needs to, you know, show an example. I don't know if Greg Sankey, uh, you know, he says he's not a part of the approval process, but listen, let's go back to Hugh Freeze. Hugh Freeze was tried to hide to, after he left Ole Miss. There's multiple schools that wanted him, and Greg Sankey will tell you that he did not block him. That is not accurate. He did. And he did multiple occasions, and uh, one of those being here in Tuscaloosa. Don't miss one moment of the Out of Bounds Show with Bo Bounds. Weekdays, 7 a.m. till 10 a.m. on ESPN 105.9. The Zone.